I'm a ninth generation American and I love an American car. Behold, Oldsmobile, 1994 Cutlass Sierra Cruiser. It's a wagon. So, what can you tell me about your car? It's a beaut. It's like um, a couch on wheels. You know, it's the ultimate form of American luxury. She's reliable. She's not as uh, gas conscious as I would like her to be, but you know, we can squeeze 300 out of the tank. Easy. It's starting to smell a little bit. Uh, runs a little rich, but um, I've had great sex in there. It's a total, total magnet, total magnet. She's got a lot of features. Top top. Roll on the truck, boom boom. This is where my earthquake kit is. Uh, it's gonna happen one day, I'm prepared. She got a spoiler. How many station wagons do you know have a spoiler? I mean, every car has a name, right? So, she started out as brass knuckle, formidable. My friends call it golden cupcake, uh, metallic antelope, uh, and goldie hawn is what one of my fags call it, so I like that too. Brass knuckle. You know, I'm, I'm pretty thrifty. I got my mechanics, they're great, but sometimes you can't afford to uh, pay for every little thing that happens. So, you know, I know a few things, so I've taken it upon my own ingenuity and basic know-how to kind of make a few repairs myself. It being an older car and all has a lot of, you know, its share of rattles, so I put this, I put this cap here, kind of, you know, put some tension there to stop the rattle. I backed into a gate and this whole thing fell off and you know, it's held onto by a giant harness of wires. So I used about three different kinds of epoxies and then said, fuck it, and just use that spray foam insulation. It's adhesive in itself, going nowhere. Oh, I shouldn't probably do that so hard. But it's been on there for two years. It's pretty cool. So I devised this little, uh, this little pulley system that pulls on the harness of wires and because there's a short in there. Um, and so, you gotta pull up like this. Sometimes it'll, like sometimes I can let it go. Oh, so you, then you have to do it some more. I was really PMS and um, hit it. Cause I was real mad at it before I figured out this rope thing. Cracked it. Uh, this is my stereo. It's, tape doesn't work, but it's my fingernail file. So that's cool. See that at stoplights. Um, you listen to talk radio on this, it's all really staticky, and then this is my stereo speaker. It sounds like you're really there. I love a cup holder. Um, this came with the car, I love it. It could fold inside the console, and then um, one night it broke off during sex, and then I was like, fuck, and so then I fixed it with some epoxy and nails, and put it in again, and then I had sex again, and it broke it off again, so I haven't fixed it yet, but I think about it all the time. I really want it back. A little peanut. See an enemy spine, it's also used as an anti squeak device. I made a lot of love in this car. Seats don't go down as fast as you'd like, it's a bit anticlimactic, but look how far it goes down. What modern car you know goes all the way down like this? It's a great car for a nap, and a working home needs a nap. A car that can be like a bed. Guess I'm taking that now. My dog.